other side he has the underhook. I'm gonna control his elbow triceps. My underhook, I'm not gonna keep my hand on his back. I'm gonna try to cut my hand on his shoulder. Just because if I need to open my elbow for uh, some takedowns or uh, it will also prevent him from trying to wizard. If he holds to here, I mean too low, it's much easier for me to wizard his arm as opposed to if he's up and I try to wizard, he pops his elbow up. So it make it harder for me. So all I'm going to do is from here, I'm going to start like pummeling. Add to the opposite side of the uh, underhook. This is not underhook. So again, well, if you guys need some time to think, it's fine, but uh, you guys should be doing like in a good rhythm here, all right? So it's just like, no, not big motions, just like hand going in. And then we're going to start like working the foot, get yeah, some footwork, and then um, tomorrow we're going to be doing the same thing, but in the cage to show how we do to have the control on the clinch in the cage. All right, so I turn off my analyst and then